What's up guys, the Apple device here, and right here is the jailbroken iPhone 4S on the 6.0 software. So I'll just show you guys that this is a real legitimate iPhone 4S, right there. And it's jailbroken on the 6.0 software, so I'll just quickly open up say, um, settings, general, about, and then right there, 6.0, and then the model number. And there's passbooks right there. And if you guys disbelievers don't believe this is the 6.0, here's the dial, here's the um, music application, and it's a whole new th um, look to it. And then I'll open up and show you the dialer for the um, phone app. As you can see, it's all new. It's white. So I'll go ahead show you guys uh, Cydia, and then. Uh, I'll scroll down and show you guys that, that it's on the 6.0. I'll try not to show my um, my UDID, but might show, okay. Right there. All right, shows, whatever. But as you can see, iPhone 4S 6.0. And City is working fairly well. As you just saw, it just reloaded changes. Here's all the changes. And... Um, yeah, it works pretty good, guys. So uh, I'll just turn the device on and off just to show that it's an untethered jailbreak and that it works smoothly. There are some glitches to this, but overall most of them have been fixed. Uh, at the end of this video, there will be a link to download this jailbreak, and the jailbreak is called um, Purple Rain. So... After it turns off, I'll turn it back on and show you guys, and then at the end of this video, there'll be a link for Purple Rain. Okay, as you saw, I just booted up. So, um, guys, I, I'll I'll get back to you guys with, with the instruction videos of how to jailbreak it, and I'll meet you guys on the other side. Guys, this was a fake jailbreak. As you guys can see, when I click on passbooks, it just crashes, and then the um, music application, pretty much. If you go back, it's nothing like um, the iOS six music application. Looks li different. And then, guys, um, I'll show you guys how I did this. And, guys, be careful when you guys uh, look at people with, with a jailbreak. If you do not know the person, don't trust them that they have a jailbreak. They can, they can just give you some virus for you, your computer, take over your computer, and steal your information. So how I did this pretty much was I downloaded iFile from um, Cydia. And I went to uh, Systems, Library or services and then went all the way down to system uh, plists and then property viewer I, th I believe it was that and I just renamed the um, model model number and then the 6.0 the version and it worked perfectly fine I'll just show you guys real quick so I'll make this to just one and then I'll make this to zero. Done. And then I'll go into settings and just show you guys that it actually worked if I can find my settings. Okay. As you can, guys can see right there, model number one and uh, version zero. So that's what I did there. And that's pretty much it, guys. I have a theme running in the background right here, winter board. 6.0 theme. That makes it look like it's 6.0, and then I got white icon labels, if you guys haven't noticed. So, okay, guys, be careful who you guys trust when it comes to jailbreaking. There's a lot of people who just claim they have a jailbreak, but it's fake, and uh, they'll be stealing your information. So, guys, subscribe to me if you guys uh, really want a good, legitimate jailbreak. Once the one jailbreak comes out for 6.0, I'll be one of the first to make a video on it. Here is um, without the theme, as you guys can see. 
I'll open up Dialer or Music Application. If I click on a song, it's it's regular, you know. And then um, the Dialer is again regular how it was previously. So guys, be careful who you trust. Uh, if if you guys uh, want to subscribe, right up there. If you guys have any um, questions, go ahead and comment, and uh, I'll catch you guys in my next video.